Hi students, I am very sorry I am not here this afternoon. I am at an appointment. So you are going to listen to this video and you are going to be very kind, respectful, and polite to our guest teacher because you have a job to do today, okay? So it says, good afternoon. Today is Thursday, March 25th. Today you will make a prepositions poster make it look great so you are going to make a poster i will show you what that looks like your learning target i can use prepositions to tell where something is located okay same learning target all week okay all right um so no warm-up today we're gonna go right to your job you are going to make a poster you will get one piece of big paper and it looks like this. On your paper, you have to do three things. Number one, you're going to choose eight prepositions. Eight. We learned nine. You have to choose eight. Then you are going to draw a picture of the preposition. Third, you're going to write a sentence, okay? So here are all the prepositions. There are one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. You choose eight. So I chose for my first preposition, in, in. So on my poster, I drew a picture of a bunny in a hat. So I chose in, I drew a picture, and now number three, I have to write a sentence. So I'm going to write, the bunny is in the hat, period. The bunny is in the hat. You have to write the sentence on the paper, okay? So number one is finished. Now you're going to do number two. Okay, number two, maybe you want to choose under. You have to draw a picture, but it cannot be a tree or a boy. Nope, it has to be something different. Maybe you want to choose on. That's okay, but it cannot be a cat or a bench. Nope, something different. Maybe you want to do next to. Okay but it can't be a table and a bear. Nope, something different. Okay, students? All right, um, Miss Rosie's here to help you and our guest teacher for you to work on your poster. When you are finished with your poster, you can practice your Quizlet for 10 minutes because we have a test tomorrow on all the prepositions. And then you can do your bingo card. Your bingo card is due tomorrow. So you have lots of stuff. Number one, do your poster. Number two, practice your Quizlet. Number three, bingo card. All right, students, good luck. And I hope I see you tomorrow. Bye.